because you are buying online doesn't mean that you are sure it is not fake because i bought online the very first time i bought this and i got it fake so one thing you should do before getting the cosrs um products is that hello guys welcome back to my channel my name is the best and the first time here you are welcome so if you're a subscriber to my channel please go ahead and hit the subscribe button okay so finally we are 1k subscribers thank you so much i appreciate it let's keep it going so today i will be talking about cosaris 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 Neomocene 96. There is 92, there is 96. And I'll be telling you how to detect the fake from the original. I got the fake too. So you don't want to fall victim of the fake. And um, is it worth all the whole hype they are giving us? And when you go to TikTok, Cosaris, Instagram, Cosaris, YouTube, Cosaris, 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 Cosaris. Is Cosaris really worth all those hype they are giving us? I'll be really, really spinning the honest truth in this video so you don't want to skip and i'll be telling you how to identify the fake from the original at the end of the video so you make sure you want to watch till the end of the video okay so now let's get started but before then i'll give you a few seconds to subscribe to my channel have you done that have you yes up there just hit the subscribe button it is free okay thank you so now moving on this is my cursors this is a Advanced Neo 96 Mosin Power Essence Cosaris. The name is quite much right. Okay, this is 96, there is 92, and um, this is the carton. This is how the packaging comes, and this is how it looks like. I'm, I'm on it, I've been using it, and I've used it up to this point, so I think I'm in the best position to review it right now. So, so they said if you use it for three days, you will see some changes let's see let's see so first one thing i will talk about is cosaris is i like the button i like the neutral color and all of that is this part of the review yes it's part of the review i love the neutral color branding and all of that so good and it makes me want to do my skincare it is not flashy and it's looking aesthetic so now moving on to the um serum it is quite thick it's quite thick and it is slimy it is really slimy all those ones you're seeing and the videos on the internet they are not light it's really slimy and um does it hydrate the skin does it moisturize the skin like really it doesn't really moisturize the skin and clear all those things that they say it clears that it, it does all those h to z wonderful does it really do this maybe not everything but yes it's worked to a good certain extent but note cosaris is not lightening cosaris is not brightening it is not anything whitening cosaris is for hydrating it's for moisturizing it's for skin plumping he said and make sure you don't lose too much moisture and um um making your skin regain the moisture it is luxury in the course of you being outside and doing your daily activities so cosaris is good for hydrating your skin and cosaris contains snail mucin and snail mucin is very good for anti-aging yes 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 snail mucin is very good for anti-aging for clearing dark spots one good thing about cosaris is that it is made in korea you know korean products are very very hyped that they are good for the skin and all of that i have not tried every korean product out there but the one i've tried they are what the hype they are what's giving all those um hype they are giving them like all those um noise like all of that it is what it it is really really what it and for cosaris cosaris is also what it but if you think it's going to lighten your skin or it is going to whiten your skin no cosaris do not do that it is just for skin hydration in one sentence to so just be straightforward it is for hydration, it is for moisturizing, skin plumping, anti-aging, and it can help you to smoothen your skin really good and then and it's giving this instant dewy glow like 
can you see it gives you this instant dewy glow so coursera does not lighten it does not brighten it is for mainly for um, skin hydration so now moving on let's talk about how to use this like what's the application step i think so because coursera is an essence not a serum so how do you use coursera uh, during your skincare routine how do you um insert it how do you incorporate what should you use before what should you use after okay let me just with this video i need why it's preparing for this video how i use my cursor and how it works for me so now watch only your palm is taking majority of the essence okay so apply it directly on your face essence is very good it helps with skin um luminosity reducing pores and fine lines getting rid of uneven and dull skin why smoothing your skin texture and making your skin look hydrated so you want to get yourself essence there are lots of essences out there now let's get into the video okay now so that's how to use the corsaris essence so if you want to get the cream also where i use my moisturizer that is when you will use your own cream and the cream is 92 that means the percent of snail inside the cream is 92 and the percent of snail um extract inside the serum is 96 so if you want to use the 92, the place where I use my facial moisturizer, my facial oil, that's where you will use your Corsaris Snail 92 as a replacement, you understand? So that's how to use it. That's just how to perfectly use it and to get that. You saw the glow, like this is still is like, this is how to use it. But one thing I must talk about this Corsaris is, it makes me sweat a bit. It makes me sweat a bit. It is not that, like, it is, I would like call it like, it generates heat. it doesn't it is not like it does not generate it so if you want to use it it's better to use it where there is enough ventilation or i always say it's always have this small fan at hand that you can use you know the country is hot the weather is hot but if you are in the states and all those cold countries then the cosaris won't even make you sweat at all but if you are in other country like ours it's might it depends on how you do sweat but for me i don't really sweat that much people that know me know i don't sweat so it makes me sweat a bit but after sometimes the everything will just seal into my skin and i won't sweat anymore that's after some time so i just apply it that's why i'm having this dewiness it's still going to go into my skin okay so you have to be aware of that and have a little bit of fun but it does not mean that the sweating doesn't make it like maybe it is not good it's just like like the first few minutes after applying the cursor it should make it might make you sweat okay so watch out for that and another thing about the cursor snail essence is that it is a bit sticky like it's not that, that that light it is lightweight but you will still feel like there is something on your skin like it's a bit sticky okay so and that's because the it is it is nail slime and the nail slime will definitely be sticky okay but don't worry it does not mean anything that is what i want to watch as well so now let's talk about how to identify the fake from the original i said i would tell you and here we are i would say watch to the end so if you did not watch to the end you won't catch you won't catch this point i'm about to give and they are vital points so when i got the cursores snail machine the first time i got it because i've been hearing about the fake 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 everywhere you believe that i order online yes i order online the brushes i was so glad i was i bought because i had snail mostly 96 and snail um um cream 92 so i was so glad i was so happy but when i opened it i saw that the consistency was somehow the, the packaging was it was like it was very identical to this one like no difference and so i was like something is wrong with this and i use this on my on my hand the back of my hand and i saw that the consistency was kind of somehow so now this is what to take note of when buying the cursorious new essence because you are buying online doesn't mean that you are sure it is not fake because i bought online the very first time i bought this and i got it fake so one thing you should do before getting the cursorious um products is that make sure there is a return policy for it okay so that if you notice that the cursorious you got is not original 
then you can return it that was the thing i did when i got the fake cost arrest there when i before i bought it i checked the description and they said there is return policy of seven days so make sure there is some policy for it so you can return it okay because the cost arrest product it is not cheap it is not cheap it is affordable to some people it is expensive to some people but if you tell me the cost arrest is cheap then no it is not cheap okay so now the number one thing you need to know is that the fake the boss will look exactly like this it look exactly like this but one thing you will notice is that this place this cap you know this cap is flat but the fake is kind of long this one is like half inch the fake i mean this cap this area let me come closer this area is a bit taller than the original that's number one point you want to note and the number two point you want to note is that look at this point look at this point you can see that it is a bit up like it is not straight it is not down like a bit up but the fake is just straight like the fake is straight like this but if you look at this one it is a bit elongated up but the fake is just like this and another thing to notice the fake and the original this is the original let me let me i put some on my palm you can see running down it is running down very slowly very very slowly but when you put the fake on your palm it should run down just like water like it is going to go like water on your skin and another point you should take note is that this one is slimy see like it's slime to certain extent if you put a lot on your skin it's going to slime very much like say it slimes well let me come let me come closer you can see it slimes really good but the fake do not slime at all like if you just touch it like this it's going to stop see how this one is slimy but if you just if you touch it like this like it's like you're touching water and um gum like maybe consistency of water and gum that's how it looks like so when you touch it it's just to a certain extent and it should stop but this one it should slime well like it should go on well on your on your face that's how you will know that you got the original same go for the machine same same go for the cream the cream also the fake is smelling like gum like when you pass it the odor it's when you smell it if you have a very keen sense of smell it smells like gum like you will know that this is not the original why the original is odorless does not have any odor at all so it smells like gum and another thing about the cream which is the 92 i'll put the bottle here the 92 this one is the 96 so i also identify the 92 okay that one too it doesn't slime at all i use it on my skin and it was just like i use normal mixture of um you know just normal moisturizer it was as if i use a normal moisturizer nothing slime nothing slimy nothing like so just like i use normal moisturizer so that is how to identify the fake and the original um from my own experience so when i realized that that one wasn't even sliming at all and it was having this odd smell of gum this odd smell of gum and something so i returned it and that's how i did not buy when i bought this one i was supposed to buy this and the 92 but I was like let me go and try this one first and if i if it's one that this one is fake then i will not buy the 92 but if this one is original i will come back for for the 92 so this one when i got it i made sure that there is a return policy on it and i got it from a cosmetic store like i went there i did not buy it online again this time around so i went there from a um cosmetic store a very big cosmetic shop and i told them about my first experience and i made them know that i don't want to buy it because i bought about three for me and my friends so when i got them they told me there is three days um return policy on it so when i got some this i got some i did not like remove the packaging anyhow i was very careful with the packaging so that if i want to return it it should be easy for me to return they won't say like maybe i i damaged the packaging or that so that's one thing you need to take notes do not damage the packaging when opening it open it with caution okay so when opening it open it with caution so you will be able to return it if there is anything you notice about it maybe it is original and maybe you understand so you, you have to be aware of the fake the fake is out there and they sell it for the same price as the original okay so for you that watch to the end of this video thank you so much so you are here already why not take a minute to click on the subscribe button okay
click on the subscribe button and thank you so much for watching up to this point watch my other videos i have a series about skincare for beginner if you're a beginner then you want to check that out go to my playlist the playlist is there and i have acne series also if you're acne prone skin and you are looking for a way to treat your acne or to keep it on the bay okay you can check my acne series playlist okay and thank you for watching up to this point i will see you on the very next one and um bye bye